friends, welcome back to another video. If you're new here, welcome, hello, my name is Rachel. If you want to stay and join my little family, click the subscribe button down below. So today's video is me telling you guys about my first day of college, which was quite a mess, to say the least. My first day of college was August 20th, which was a Monday. I had just come back from Vegas. Yes, this is how long ago this was. I had already emailed my teacher asking what room he was in and I hadn't gotten a response. And there was like no online section that would tell you what room they were in, but it would tell you their office number. So we figured out what building he was in and I had never been like on campus wandering around looking at the buildings before. So we went and we explored the campus looking for the building. So we got to the building and started wandering around it. We couldn't get inside the doors locked obviously because it was the day before school started. But then we found like a teacher's list and like it had their office number but it didn't have their room number. So we left and at least I had figured out what building he was in. Monday, August 20th happens and my class starts at 10. I was awake. I was at school by 9 o'clock. I went into the main hall, which is like a student service center. I got in line to wait to ask someone behind the desk what room he was in. This counselor comes up to me and was like, am I able to help you? And I was like, I'm looking to find so-and-so's, my teacher's name, what room he's in. And so she pulled me out of line and was like, okay, can you log into your account? And so I tried logging into my account and it said password incorrect. I tried again with a different version of the password, still incorrect. So I reset my password and I tried to log in yet again, still incorrect even though I just reset the password. So I was like, okay, this is weird and I was like, hey, it's not working, I even reset my password and it still said wrong password. So she pulled me into this office where there's another student aide and like went on the website and started looking for this teacher like his name and she couldn't find it and I was she was like who are you looking for and I told her his name again and she was like I've never heard of that teacher's name and so I like pulled it up on my phone to show them his name and she was like couldn't find it on their like teachers list and she was like I don't think he works here are you sure you're on the correct campus and I was like yeah, like I signed up through you guys and all that. And this is the teacher I signed up for. It's a hybrid class. It's intro to statistics. This is his name. And I was pronouncing it wrong. No one could pronounce it. No one knew how to pronounce it. It, yeah, great time. The student that was sitting in the office behind the desk was like, oh, he's a new teacher. And so the counselor gets on the phone and starts calling all these people and is like, do you know who this teacher is? Blah, blah, blah. And she gets off the phone and she's like, I don't believe he works here. And then the student off the side was like, he started here this summer. And then the counselor starts calling more people and finds out his office number. And then a room number. I was like, okay, thanks for your help. And then I left and went and got back in line with the student services, waited my turn, walked up. And I was like, hey, can you help me find this teacher? And she was like, what class is it? What time is the class? And like, what's his name? I was like, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but I'm going to enter the statistics at 10 o'clock. And at this point it was like 9.30, 9.40ish. So I show her his name on the phone and she's like, oh, okay. And she looks him up on the computer and she gives me his office number and a different room number. So I was like, all right, thanks. And I walked out, down the hill to the building onto the first floor, it's a three-story building, I walked onto the first floor and walked in on the far left side and it started at 112 and the other side was 101. I was like, okay, so I have to like run into his room because the doors were alternating numbers. So I was walking down the hall, it goes like 112, 101, you turn the corner, it's like 102, 103. And then I got to where I knew some people from high school and I was like, hey, do you know where this room number is? They were going into 107, which was right like behind me. So I walked down the next hall and it was 106. And I was like, where is 105? I need room 105. So I went back to them. They weren't any help for me. 
and I was like, what math class are you guys going to? They're like, intro to algebra. And I was like, okay. So I just walked away because that's not the class I was looking for and they weren't gonna be any help. So I walked away, I started walking through the building again. I was like, did I miss the number? I was looking for 105. It starts at 112 and 101. You walk around and it stops at 106 on the other side of the building. So I walk outside. I notice the rooms on the outside and it's like 108 and I was like 105, thank God. And I didn't know if that was his correct room number because I was told two different room numbers plus his office, which I already knew. Me being me, scared to talk to people, I asked this one girl, I was like, hey, what class are you here for? And she was like, intro to statistics. And I was like, awesome, what teacher? And she told me the teacher and I was like, oh my God, bless. It was the correct teacher and I was like, thank God. And by the time I got to class, it was like two minutes before class started. And I was there an hour before and it took me that long to find where my first class was. It was a mess. So I got home after that class and I cried some because I was like, that was really stressful and things that shouldn't happen do happen to me when it's a very unnecessary, but it does. It's just my luck. And that was the story of my first day at college. I hope you guys got a laugh out of it. A bunch of people that asked me how my first day of college went, I told them a shortened version of that story and they all laughed. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you're not already and you want to see more from me. Make sure to push the bell to turn on push notifications so you're notified every time that I post and I'll see you guys next week.